Nobody can pronounce it. <laughs> Sorry, mate. So j- we're just going to do something a little bit completely different tonight. So um, just um, how you going, mate? I'm very well, thank you. How you doing? Oh, not too bad. Not too bad. I'll just turn your vocal up a little bit there. Please do. We Hello. Found, we found that microphone stand. It's pretty shit. It's fucking beautiful, man. Yeah. I like yeah. the tape. Yeah. So... I'm going to talk about something that means a lot to me, and um, it's a very special part of life, and uh, I just don't even want you to judge it too much, but let me just... <laughs> yeah, it's a phallic object. What's going to happen with this? A little pumping, maybe? Mm. Anyway, right, what I am going to talk about is... I might do a balloon animal. But then again, I might just talk about the sacred art of ah Tantra. Right, I don't know if any of you know about Tantra, but basically what it's all about is you... Oh, ah, basically you're pumping and making energy from down here, and then you rising it up to up here. Ah, refining energy, one might say, and all sorts of pumping. Ah, I mean, basically, if you get an egg, and you crack the egg, you make an omelette, and then you use the energy from that omelette to sing a song. This is, ah, pumping. Ah. Always with the mind on God. You must keep pumping as hard as you can uh, with your mind on God for long enough. Uh, I know, who fucking knows. And then one day, uh, if you're lucky enough, with your mind on God, and you've pumped hard enough <laughs> in the right place, of course. <sighs> then one day, Ah, peace. Ah. Oh, right, ah, back on earth again. Marvellous. So, when you do come back after the big explosion, ah, it's always good to keep on pumping. And uh, one of the most amazing things about this pumping, and you keep going and going and going with your mind on God, always, ooh. So I need a little practice. Cockatoo Paul has my number if anyone's interested. (coughs) Anyway, so, the sacred art of Tantra and life in itself needs and requires a very brave and curious soul. Uh, And I might need one of those right now, actually. So, are there any brave, curious people out there who want to come up and give me a hand? Anybody? Marvellous. Get your ass over here then. Maybe a little naive also, but it's okay. <laughs> Do you like putting things in your mouth? <sighs> I like that. Say you love that. I love that. I love robot penis. <laughs> well, we'll go from robot to latex, okay? So what I need you to do... You do, I'm afraid. Well, I'm not afraid. Okay, this will make... Hang on, this will make it feel a little better. You can, yeah, and I'll just stick that between my legs if that just makes it all... Shall I bend down for this one? Yeah, just don't use your hands. I'm going to bend? Say it again. <laughs> anyway, stick it in your mouth, and when I squeeze, you suck, okay? I'm going to pop in my mouth. Oh, if, <laughs> only if you suck it, prof. <laughs> no, <laughs> right. Okay. Ah. <sighs> Cockatoo Paul has her number also. <laughs> Anyone else? Right. And in the clo- you can close the mouth to suck. Okay. Is it your first time? Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> and suck. And let it grow in your mouth. Let it grow and let it out of the mouth once it's starting growing. Yeah. Ah. Oh, it's a nice feeling, huh? <sighs> Marvellous. Thank you very much. Bit of a round of applause. <laughs> it is. Wonderful. <laughs> Oh, Christ. 
Oh, that one's no good. <laughs> so, where was I? More fucking pumping, yes. <laughs> now, in life, at some point, if you continue uh, looking deep inside yourself and trying to uh, keep pumping with your mind on God, at some point, for sure, you're going to start feeling a wee bit deflated and useless. These things happen, you know. And at these points, you need to really remember that life is probably going to get worse before it gets better. But that's what fucking happens. It does. And probably at some point, you're going to feel like you're dead, twisted, lunatic, in a lot of fucking trouble. Like, what the fuck am I doing? Where have I been on this world? Who am I? Why am I standing here playing with latex balloons and half a dozen sausages in me hand? <laughs> and that's about it, really. So at these points, when you are really fucked up in the head, I want you to really remember that it doesn't matter who you are, what you've done, what you think, how you act, you're always a very beautiful manifestation of this universe. Doesn't matter what you do. Always. Yay. So enjoy life, huh? Ah. Oh, look at that. He, he made a cancerous teddy bear. It's awesome. It's awesome. Do you want to play? Ah, oh, he goes to the hottie in the front row. Fantastic. Okay. Um,